Right, here comes the 158. Passing through now is 43188 and 43186. The Welsh runs again. It's nice to see that train again with 186, as I had that train down yesterday. Off it goes, bending around the corner in three milestone. Bloody good view this. Passing through now is Great Western Railways 802113. This was my set this morning to Truro, passing three milestone at 1054. With some sick tones passing through three milestone. The driver definitely knew me. And off it goes over there. The other side of our nice little bridge. Tom Perro Farm Road Overbridge. Three milestone. Try it out sometime, you know. And passing through here is 802 triple one on one Charlie 69 from London Paddington to Penzance. Off it goes to Penzance, passing our little bridge at 1104. Coming in now is 802103 on the Great Western Railway, one Charlie 76 service from London Paddington pulling it going to Penzance. And another IET is pulling in as well. This one's coming in, and there's one part there as well. So, two IETs. I'll be travelling Coach K today, down to St. Earth. This one's always busy, so here it is. Here's the door. Parting out now is 802-103. On Great Western Railway service, 1 Charlie 76 to Penzance. Off goes 43093. On 5 Charlie 79 to Long Rock. That goes to Long Rock, part next to a nice RET. The part now, now is A hundred three hundred three on two Papa twenty nine. Off to Plymouth from Penzance. With a really nice TM on that train and a lovely host. I must say, I should have stayed on that to Plymouth with the crew I had on that, but we've got to deal with the St. Ives Bay line for a bit longer tonight. Bash out two more services is what I want. Approaching now is a HSC that's approaching way too fast. 098 at the front. Walton Castle. And 194 Oakhampton Castle at the rear. The 
Pine out now is a very well thrashing 43194 and a 43098. Off he goes. To Pine St. Earth, a minute and a half later, 2027. Pattern out now is Cross Country 231144 and 1 Victor 58 from Edinburgh to Penzance. The Pattern St. Earth at 2037. This will be my set coming back on 2 Charlie 80 on the return portion of this to Plymouth in the back of the train. As I now know that Rachel's the train TM, which is the decider and choice maker for me. There you go, Rachel gave me a nice wave. Thanks, Rachel. I reckon she knows I'm coming back with her now, just because I've seen her on the train. Like, every time it's her, I don't mind getting the Voyager. Not a problem with me to get a Voyager. As long as there's a nice TM or host on it, etc. Anyways, off it goes. The fast train now approaching platform 2 does not stop here. It's 802113. Passing straight through St. Earth. Oh my god, it's got some speed for impatience. Off it goes to London Paddington, with an amazing sound being made by the points at St. Earth, where you connect to St. Ives. Approaching it now is 57602 Restore Malt Castle on Great Western Railways, 1 hour for 50 service from Penzance to London Paddington. This is doing stop to pick up only to Totnes, then calling at Totnes, New Abbot, Exeter St. David's, Taunton, Reading and London Paddington. Where at Reading it'll pick up 57312 to go on the rear. So it can haul it out on 5 hours for 50 to train care after. Here is 602. Very nice 57. And funny I should say, this beast has only got 6 coaches on it tonight. Not bad. It's interesting, it's really interesting. It's only got six. Got one there, one here, it's two, three, four, five, six. See you later. Off goes this very rare, unusual occasion. A sleeper of only six coaches. And just to note, this sleeper has a barrier coach, and I do not know why. Very rare allocation this evening. Approaching in now is Cross Country Voyager 221144. On 2 Charlie 80 from Penzance to Plymouth. Pulling in St. Earth at 22.14. Nice to have a Voyager. This will get me back home for midnight 02 to Plymouth. And I will be picking up another Voyager in the morning to do the 5.25. So I'll be on the final Voyager of the night and the first Voyager of the morning. That carriage seems a bit locked out of use.